Hey, I hope I'm not too late. I just got back. I had to drop the kids off. Did I... Did I blank on a breakfast date? Because I, I'm actually... I'm here to make breakfast. Me too. Oh. Uh, well, when he said he needed to see me, I... Hey. I'm glad you both could make it. Uh, oh, what is that? What is this? I'm leaving Pine Valley. You're leaving? I thought you had to finish your community service. This allows me to do that somewhere else. Where? Chile. I'm going to go oversee the new Miranda Center over there. Wow. After we, we just set up the center here. I know. I know, and I, I still plan on staying involved. I just... I can't be as hands-on as I originally hoped for. But don't worry, I'm not going to leave you on the lurch. I'm going to get you a good replacement. For you, good luck. Thank you. I'm sorry. I really wanted to see this through. Uh, when, are you, when are you going? Today. And not to drop the bomb and leave, but I'm still not packed. I don't want to miss my flight. I really want to be there for a breaking ground. I got to be there from start to finish on this one. Okay, well then, then you, you better get going. Yeah. It's been a pleasure. What are you gonna do without me? Not on your case. Driving me nuts. I'll survive. Well, uh, I, uh, I, uh, guess we better go. Good luck. Yeah. You too. That's it? What? Good luck? See you later. What the hell else was I supposed to say, Binks? Ask him not to go? But you didn't. Why not? I don't... And if I wanted Griff to stay. All right, even though I want him to stay... Thank you. It doesn't matter now. Because this assignment in Chile is court-ordered. Well, he could get it changed. No, no. Out there, saving the world, that's where Griff wants to be. That's, that's where he should be. Yeah, even though it's killing you. Did I say that? You didn't have to. Why are you on my case about this? Because if I had the guts to put myself out there, then so should you. Whoa, hold on a second, wait. Back up. Marissa? You, you told her that you had feelings? For feelings? Uh, yeah, I, I mean, I didn't, I didn't feel like that, but <laughs> yes. Okay, good. And? And? Um, what do you think? The feelings weren't mutual. Shocker. Since she's straight. I'm sorry. It's okay. That's what I thought her response would be. It's actually kind of a relief. You know, it was this big elephant in the room that was always there whenever we were together. I, I couldn't handle it anymore. And honestly, it feels good. Because now I can finally, truly move on. Well, then, I'm glad. All right. I said what I needed to say to someone who needed to hear it. You should try it sometime. I'm sorry, I'm just... You know, I'm anxious to get over there and make a difference. If that's what you really want to do, you can make a monumental difference here working with me. I made a promise to start these new Miranda Centers, and I can't get community service through you. That's true. You're right. Okay, well, I'm sorry to see you go. But you made me very proud to see you. Thank you. Yeah. And I'm not just talking about the medicine part. Remember what I taught you back in residency? 
When in doubt, I? <laughs> no. <laughs> Always keep the professional and personal separate. I'm glad to see you were listening. I know you had your temptations, but you're walking away clean. No attachments, no obligations. And that is essential for the success of people like us. Yeah. Look where that's gone, you. I said what I needed to say to someone who needed to hear it. You should try it sometime. What is this? That's your chart. I talked to the doctor who's taking over your case, and I got him up to speed. But in case anything comes up, or if he has any questions, I covered everything in there. Hey, you think he'll be able to read your chicken scratch? You can. Yeah, well, I'm gifted. Before I forget, here's this card. Okay. Dr. Herbert Baum. Sounds very doctorly. Yeah, he won't be as easy on the eyes, clearly, but uh, you'll get used to him. Guess I'll have to. This is so weird. What? That you're here. I, I, I was just about to call you. Yeah? Yeah, um, I just, it was just Miranda Center stuff. I, I just wanted the number to the, the medical supply company. I don't have it on me, but I'll get it to you. I promise. Thanks. So, uh, so when does your flight leave? A couple hours. Well, I mean, you couldn't have had time to pack. Lucky for me, I don't have a lot of stuff. Oh, don't sell yourself short. You do. You have got anoraks and, and <laughs> rucksacks and those those crazy, ugly boots. Yeah, rucksacks? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> ba backpack, whatever you call it. Um, that night feels like forever ago, doesn't it? Still pretty fresh in my mind. Well... Uh, you better get going. I, I do not want to be the reason that you are late because I will never hear the end of it. It's just one more thing I have to do before I go. What's that? Listen to your heart. i Take a deep breath. Not so deep this time. It's good. Good? Oh, please, admit it. I am the best patient you have ever oh, had. Oh, you definitely made things interesting. I'll give you that. You remember the first time I listened to your heart? Mm. You were in bad shape. Yeah, I was a little hesitant to put my life in the hands of a complete stranger. Hesitant. Is that code for fighting tooth and nail? It's a new definition. Why don't you look it up? I will. Okay, so we, we got off to a rough start. Oh, you really made me sweat. You know that? Trying to earn your trust. Yes, but you did. Only had to save your life once or twice. Well, yeah, but who's counting, right? And after all of that, look at us now. Yeah, look at us. I still think about it all the time. You put everything on the line for stop, me. Stop, stop, stop. You didn't know. Well, uh, yeah, I should have. If I had trusted you the same way that you trusted me, I should have known. Ricky did a number on all of us. Well, I don't care. Griffin, I... I am so sorry. It's 
water under the bridge. That's how friends roll, right? Well, if you were just a friend, I would say yes. But you're more than that, and you know it. More than just a friend, huh? Yes, you are my doctor. <laughs> you are my doctor, at least for a few more minutes. So, yeah. Uh, yeah, so are we done here or, or what? You know I can see through the whole tough girl act, right? Oh, okay, so you're a heart surgeon and you have x-ray vision. That's ooh, very impressive. Ooh, using humor to cover the angst, that's classic. Oh, okay, uh, so yeah. what kind of angst am I hiding? How much you're going to miss me. <laughs> okay, yes, okay, you, yet again, have it backwards. You're the one who's gonna be crying yourself to sleep every night wondering what I'm doing. What you're wearing, maybe. Oh, come on, would you come on, would you just say it? I will if you will. Okay, fine, on three. On three. Uh, wait, wait, hold on, do we do it in, in place of three or where four would be? Where four would be. <sighs> okay. Okay. One, two, two three. three. I'll I miss, miss you. you. See? Is that so hard? You've been so busy listening to my heart, so let me hear what yours has to say. <laughs> I don't think so. Okay, can I... Come on, Griff, will you come on? What? Just give you it know, up, come you know, on. My heart has never been the problem. Yes, well, you never know. You never know. Why do you... Seriously, why do you want to listen to my heart? Because... Well, for... Okay. First of all, to make sure you actually have one. You're so funny. Yes, and, and second of all, <laughs> <yeah>. <laughs> second of all, I hate it when you get all serious. All right. All right. You're on. Go for it. Let's okay. see what you got. I will. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. So, mm -hmm. um, I, uh, I would imagine they have a big brass band just just waiting for you when you arrive in Chile. Right? Oh, yeah, yeah, whole symphony orchestra. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, everybody bowing down to the amazing Dr. Castillo as he swaggers down out of the plane. Swaggers? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, swagger. You know, you, you, you do swagger. I, I've managed to take you down a swagger or two. What are you going to do without me? Without me to be a punching bag? <laughs> I'm gonna put a picture of you on my wall. Oh, uh, yeah? Mm -hmm. mm hmm. And then I'm gonna practice my kickboxing. Oh, well. It's only if your new doctor says it's okay. Um, yeah, I don't think I'm actually ready for a new doctor yet. Your heart sounds strong. The new doctor has to be improvement from the old one. Seeing how you would love to complain about me. Yeah, you and your terrible bedside manner. I've never had any complaints about my manners. Bedside-wise. I'm sure. Well, <clears throat> I really should get going. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> There's only... That, yeah, right. I'm fixing that up. There's only one flight to Chile and... Uh, you, uh, you have to be on it. I really want you to take care of yourself, Kendall. You too. <sighs> Come <laughs> Wait.